Hey guys, me and Dave. It's uh, 8 24 2020. So I got my EMF hat on. Um, it's not really doing anything. Um, I've been getting hit all day uh, since 1 o'clock. Um, my relative wanted to go look at a house. It was 30 miles away. Um, I made it about 18 miles. I was getting nailed. So I had a, we had to turn around and go home. Um, I was just getting, I was getting nailed, uh, really uncomfortable, they were making my stomach upset, uh, it felt like the frequencies were going through my whole body, my arms and everything, and then, um, you know, they, like I said before, they, they do it a little bit, just enough to make a difference, where you're, you're, you're questioning, you know, you're like, I think they're hitting me, but I'm not sure, you know, or is it, because we had the air conditioner, air conditioning on, you know, so I'm like, I, I don't know if they're hitting me, or if I'm getting, feel like crap, you know, getting sick from the air conditioner that's running, you know, but they were hitting me, uh, it almost felt like I had a, like a, a hangover, they were microwaving my head a little bit, you know, they were just, just doing it enough, uh, to make a difference where I was very, very uncomfortable, and I'm, I, I, you know, I told my relative, I, I'm like, how far is this place and, and stuff, you know, and she's like, well, it's quite a ways further, you know, and I'm like, I, I can't make it, I can't make it, we gotta, we gotta turn around and go home, um, that's how uncomfortable it was, um, you know, with these frequencies and stuff, so they've been doing it, um, one o'clock until now, they're still doing it now, putting these uncomfortable frequencies in me and then kind of make my stomach a little upset at the same time but it, it's it's like going through my whole body it feels like I don't know if that's actually what's happening but it feels like it's going through my whole body you know my arms my you know you know this part you know middle of my body and all this stuff to my stomach you know make my stomach a little upset and all this stuff and then my head my head feels like it feels like I have a hangover. It feels like I'm getting microwaved a little bit, you know? It's very, um, you know, it's almost like I'm agitated or uneasy and, um, you know, and stuff. Um, I can't take, you know, the medication doesn't work. I got Trazodone. It doesn't do anything. I could take two of them. I could take four of them. You know, I mean, it, it you know, it would make me groggy, but... It, um, you know, I, I think they can kind of block the stuff, block the medications so it doesn't work, you know, and stuff. So, I've been getting hit the last, uh, we're going on eight hours now. So, there, you could tell it's like in a looping pattern because, <coughs> um, it ha, you know, it's not a continuous feeling. It, 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 they hit you and then they lay off and then a couple minutes you know two or three minutes later they'll do it again and then lay off so obviously it's I don't know is it AI supercomputer that's doing the attack um, is it set at like every three or four minutes you know because they do it and then they lay off you it's like a looping pattern boom lay off boom they lay off you you know so that's what I've been going through the last uh, almost eight hours um, I don't know if they're mad at me you know oh because I went for a ride can't go for a ride oh my god how dare you go for a ride so we're gonna torture you for the next 10 hours or so they'll probably do it through the night I don't know you know so um, uh, you know we'll have to see what happens um, tonight, um, if I'm going to be able to sleep or if I'm going to be up all night being tortured, um, you know, it's, uh, I don't know what else to do. I've contacted everyone, contacted everyone. I'm hoping payback will be a bitch for these people and, you know, I wish it would come for these people, you know, these people need to be put in their place. Are they waiting for me to call somebody? For them to 
be put in their place. Then an agency will get involved. You know, one of the agencies will get involved if I end up calling somebody for help or something. Okay, then, then we'll get other people involved and, you know, they kind of put them in their place a little bit. You know, so, um, I don't know what's going to happen tonight, so we'll have to wait and see. I, you know, I try to shield and all this stuff, nothing works. I got aluminum window screen that I bought off Amazon a while back, you know, a couple years ago, and I have a big, thick, rubber, uh, uh, air mattress, you know, I mean, I, you know, some people say rubber works the block you know this this hat doesn't really seem to do anything I'm just kind of desperate in trying to lighten up the attacks but it doesn't seem to work at all you know and you know when I bought the hat uh, on the website um, I can't remember where I got it from it was from a different country you know I bought it because they were blocking phone phone signals with the hat you know I'm like oh that's gotta be pretty good maybe it'll help me a little bit you know I paid like 35 bucks for the hat doesn't seem to work against these weapons I mean they get through it you know I get through anything you know uh, grounding doesn't seem to work at all um, you know you could take a bath or a shower or something like that but that might not work either you know I mean I took a bath you know and uh, yesterday or whatever and it doesn't seem to do much, you know, um, unless you hop in the shower to get relief or go down in the basement and grab a, grab a cold water pipe, you know, down in the basement. I don't know. Maybe that'll work. I don't know. It's worth a try. I'll try anything right now, you know, to try to lighten up the attacks, you know, but, um, so I'm getting nailed, uh, been getting nailed, uh, all day, all afternoon, um, and they're still not letting off me, um, you know, I don't know what's going on, um, nobody gets back to me, you know, nobody gets back to me, you know, I, I, I contact people, and, you know, nobody gets back to me, you know, I don't know what are they what are they waiting for? You know, waiting for me to call the police, and then the police will come. Well, they're not they're not going to take over a psych ward again and spend another million dollars. You know, I don't know how much it costs. You know, half a million. You know, and get perps in there with COVID nineteen, and you know what I mean. They're not going to do that. They're just not going to do it. You know, so if I call the cops, he'll be like, "Well, go see the doctor and see if you can get on medications." Well, the medications don't work. You know, they don't do anything for agitation, and it's all artificial. They're putting agitation in you and all this stuff with these frequencies, and it doesn't work, you know? So, it's, uh, that's kind of my story tonight, you know? I, 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 um, when we got back, I, you know, I hopped in bed again. I'm like, I gotta go lay down. So, I, I laid down all afternoon from probably 1.30 until 3.30, and then I had to feed the dogs and all that stuff. And then um, I laid back down at about quarter to six. You know, and until about 7.15. And then I thought, well, I haven't been, you know, well, I mean, I, w I went out earlier and I got hit. But, you know, I was still kind of getting hit. I'm like, I'm going to try to get out of the house for a little bit, 20 minutes or whatever. So I, I went for a little ride through the West End here, which is, you know, kind of our neighborhood here, and, and uh, <clears throat> you know, went for a little ride and all this stuff, and then came home, I was home, I, I was only gone for 20 minutes, I, it was like 20 to 8, and, um, by the time I got home and stuff, and then I laid on my bed, you know, uh, for a while, and then, you know, I just kind of got up now, but, so I'm thinking of, what, what do I have around here to shield with? You know, I'm going to start cutting up some screen. I'm going to start, I don't know, should I cut up that uh, air mattress and 
you know, put it in my hat or I don't know what to do. You know what I mean? You're, you get desperate and, you know, you know, I could be very creative when it comes to shielding. Um, you know, so, uh, I got, I don't, they got rid of all my junk. When I was in the psych ward the first time or the second time for five weeks, they tore down my enclosure. They tore down, um, all my stuff and they got rid of it you know they they got rid of it threw it in the garbage all my shielding things i was building an enclosure and i had some old old window screen screen that worked i mean you know people say you shouldn't put it against your skin this stuff you put against your skin right on your skin and it blocked it blocked these microwaves it blocked you know it was old it was like 30 year old window screen you know good stuff you can't get the good stuff now everything is chintzy and cheap and all this stuff you know so this was like 30 year old window screen that stuff i caught up and put in a, a in a beanie hat and it worked i'm telling you it worked so if you have any old window screen and stuff you know it's older stuff older copper you know you could find vintage copper bowls on ebay you know, and stuff like that. That stuff works better rather than going to Lowell's or Menards or something where, you know, the, the stuff is is cheaper now. I mean, if you look at, a, look at an old penny from 1976, it's dark, it's full copper, you know, it's heavier, you know, and you look at the new pennies today, they're lighter in color, they're cheapy, you know, cheapy, you know, made, you know, and stuff. I mean, you know, and that's kind of the way the, the copper is, you know. You could buy an old vintage copper bowl, you know. If you're desperate, put it over your head. I don't know. It's worth a try to block some of this crap out if you're getting hit hard, you know. Um, so stuff like that might work a little bit better than some of this new stuff you buy. It's just, it's cheaper, it's, you know, it's not full copper or full aluminum, you know, like, you know, like some of this new window screen that you buy, it's cheaper, you know, it's not as good as like the stuff 30 years ago where it was fully copper, or, you know, aluminum and stuff, so... So my mind's going because I don't know if I'm going to get hit more all night or what, you know? So my mind's working right now. I'm thinking, how am I going to defend myself? You know, what do I have around here that will defend my, you know, where I can defend myself and stuff? So my wheels are turning. I can be very creative sometimes. <laughs> and, you know, you have to do what you have to do, you know? Um, so that's my story for tonight. Anyway, uh, that's what's going on with me. Um, they're kind of laying off me right now because I'm making the video, but you know, it could, it'll probably come back when I'm done making the video and stuff. Um, you know, but it's it's been we're going on eight hours now. You know, eight hours, eight eight hours. Last week it was thirty six hours. Last week thirty six hours straight. You know, who does that? You know, you gotta be an effing psychopath to sit there and stare the screen and hit whatever buttons or do whatever to hit, hurt an innocent person in his bed. You know, in his own house, in his own bed. You know, for thirty-six hours. You know, not not one hour, not two hours, thirty-six hours. And tonight we're going on eight hours. Eight hours. You know, eight hours, not 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 two hours, not an hour. You know, eight eight hours so far, so far. So I could be up all night getting tortured. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. We'll have to see what happens. You know, um, you know, I you know, I don't know. You know, I wish somebody would put these jerks in their place. I really do. Um, you know. It's, you know, I wish somebody, I, you know, I wish their, wish their time was running out, um, and somebody would put them in their place. 
all I know is if I call somebody, there's going to be an agency that's going to get involved, you know, in this, um, you know, and stuff, um, because they always, you know, when I, if I call for help or something like that, they always get involved, um, you know, no matter what time it is, you know, somebody else will get involved and stuff, so, I don't know. All right, the dog's barking. I'm going to cut this off. I hope you guys are doing better than I'm doing right now. Um, stay safe out there, and I'll talk to you later.